Good morning and welcome to today's motivational rant. I'm continuing my talk about sleep or sleep hacks. And today I want to talk about temperature and climate. There's a couple of things in this hack today. And number one is a warm bath. They say that having a warm bath right before bed is a great way um, to go into a deeper sleep and have a really relaxing sleep. Because what happens is when you have a warm bath, your body temperature obviously heats up, but then the cool down process is quite quick and rapid. And that's what puts your body into a better relaxing state for sleep. So the second thing to that is your room temperature. Now they say the ideal temperatures, and I think this is a bit of a range, is between 16 and 21 degrees. Now you want to be somewhere in the middle, so around 18 degrees. So I think that's why it's nice to have the fan on in, in summer and maybe just a sheet on, depending on where you live, of course. When I was living my, in Japan, I had these hacks really down pat. And at the moment, I really don't. But I certainly noticed the um, better sleep that I had and the more energy I had when I woke up every day. So the warm bath was one thing I did every night. And the best thing about the warm bath was I could sit in there for half an hour and read a book at the same time. And then the sleep, um, going to sleep in that temperature, um, it was obviously a lot cooler in Japan at night. So all you have to do is put on some dunas depending on the time of the year. In Australia, it's a little bit different. In summer, it's particularly harder. Um, but a sheet and the fan works well. But even in winter, turning that fan just on a little bit to have circular motion, keep the room temperature nice and cool. Those two things, climate, temperature, body temperature, is going to really help you improve your sleep. That's sleep hack number three. I hope you enjoyed this one, guys. Check it out at thehiddenwire.com. Subscribe if you're not already a listener there. Thanks for listening.